Huh. Okay. I think I got this. And Mark Ingram is going to New Orleans. Weird. And they wanted their guy. They'll trade up to get him. I think you, they got Cam Jordan and Mark Ingram. That's a pretty good deal. I mean, let's assume they didn't give up the bank for this. This is actually a pretty good draft for New Orleans. Hmm. They gave up their first round pick. Oof. That's kind of crazy. So it looks like the bottom part of the draft <laughs> is not looking to turn out the way anybody thought. No. Jesus. You know, he, he compliments Reggie Bush really well. He's a power, he's a, he's a big, hard-nosed kind of runner, you know? I think, yeah. and Reggie Bush, Bush is a is an agile, speedy guy. Yeah, you put him as a change of pace kind of back. Yeah, I like this this uh, poll on Big Blue View. How would you grade the Giants' selection of Prince of Mukamara with the nineteenth pick? Four hundred fifteen votes. Three hundred thirty six of them a home run. Two fire Jerry Reese. F. I guarantee you those were two Eagles fans who were still pissed. <laughs> What? <laughs> Why is the SBN showing a Nerf commercial? No.
Series covered of the 2011 NFL Draft presented by Bud Light and brought to you by DMC, the official team of the NFL. We bought real flags, Apple Music, Protector, and Buffalo Wild News, News, Sports. We're back at Radio City Music Hall in New York. Everybody's playing in here. Dear Spike Ingram, now our plan to destroy Mr. Bond is nearing its completion. With the New Orleans Saints on the clock, having given up a number one next year, and it's due to New England about three two tomorrow, it looks as if the Heisman Trophy winner of a year ago, Mark Ingram, will be going to the New Orleans Saints if we're to read the team here. And here's the commissioner making a pick. With the 28th pick in the 2011 NFL draft, the New Orleans Saints select Mark Ingram, running back Alabama. So the Saints have taken two players who dance for the NFL. Mark Ingram, Steve Gordon has taken the side. Mm-hmm. Bears have already selected. How natural are his hands? ESPN is accusing Mark Ingram of having artificial robot hands. You know, it, it, it's a very scary thing, you know? It could happen. That's why he does not fumble. <laughs> I actually can't see Karimi to Chicago. I think that is the pick. Oh... <sighs> James and, what the fuck, man? And this is where Jason predicted the first Brooks Reed to go. Right? No, wait, 29. So, Derek, Derek Sherrod is yeah. his prediction here. Ah. <sighs> Yeah, um, lady. Yeah, why did why did he send you send you that email? Why didn't he send it to his son directly? Go away, Colbert.
Oh, bother. Oh, bother. <sighs> They're probably going to try and stretch out every pick now so that they can fill up their time slot. Yeah, I'm sure they'll do some really long uh, coverage, analyze each pick. I really, really hope that they do, as opposed to taking ten minutes on each of the next four picks. Oh, God, the Bears made their pick. Fucking announce it. <laughs> Might they? Get the fuck off the stage! go. Gabe Karimi. There you go. I fucking love Karimi, man. I'm glad he's in Chicago. Go Chicago. Alright. Three more chances for Jason, starting with his second Brooks Reed. <laughs> Brooks Reed, try number two. You know, even if they do select Brooks Reed, we shouldn't even give it to him. We should say, no, you said that they were going to pick his clone. <laughs> yeah, you said they were going to get one half of Brooks Reed. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so dickish. Jesus, Jets only have two minutes left. Oh, my God, commercial break, seriously? Come on. Go ahead, Brack. Okay. Do, 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 do. chanting, we want Bowers. I can't hear a thing that you're saying, but keep on talking. Mm -hmm. 